day five, and the manhunt has intensified here. Heavily armed teams fanning out across this area of upstate New York, walking through pastures, wading into ponds, and pushing into the thick woods, searching for any sign that may lead them to convicted murderers Richard Matt and David Sweat. I just hope they find him soon because it's, you know, we've never locked our doors before and, you know, never had to worry, but these men are, are bad news. A convicted murderer who testified against Matt in court asked us to alter his voice and hide his identity, but couldn't hide his concern. There's no telling what kind of revenge he may want to exact on people that I love, uh, people that are close to me. This is a, a very psychotic individual. In Dannemora, just a few miles from the prison where the men escaped last week, officers are again going door to door in a community on edge. They don't know where they are. They could be in Canada. Who knows? But they could be in these woods, and uh, you just you don't know. Investigators also don't know how the violent inmates carried out their elaborate escape. But now have identified 51-year-old Joyce Mitchell, a supervisor in the prison tailor shop, as a person of interest in the case. As the search and investigation continues. Jay Gray, NBC News, Dannemora, New York.